So this is a tutorial on delta rings. So this is composed of two deltas and then combined. So I have a tutorial that I'll add to the description where I show how to make an alternate form of this delta, but uh, in this video I'll show how to make the ones I use to make these rings. So <clears throat> you need hexagons, three of them, and connect them like this, and the third one. So the next step is to bend one of these downwards. So you have two choices, like this. Or like this. So I'll describe what those two, the meaning of those. Okay, so we brought this side down, down, and we're going to add two magnets, like that, one to the end. Okay, the second step is to fill in this area. You need to make something like this. Okay, and fill in this last one here, row of three. Okay, so we're halfway there. Now you need like this. Six. Okay, and here we have the delta. Now, to connect, to make one like this where they connect like this, you're going to need to build one that's opposite polarity of this one. So, this is how we do that. Again, start with three these. Combine them as in the previous manner. And <clears throat> these three magnets will form these three magnets here. So when we, and the side that you fold down, we'll fold, we'll, uh, we'll make this part here. So in order to make one that's opposite polarity of this one, we can hold it up to this see that this way would make one of like polarity and if we flip it over it'll make one of opposite polarity so I'll do this process again fill in this gap here these gets inserted to the inside on the other side it's one of these first and then a ring of six Now we have two deltas of opposite polarity. Okay, these are opposite. These are going to be opposite. So are these. So it's seemingly opposite polarity, but there is a front and a back. Because when we were building this shape, the, uh, the, f the magnetic field, line, field lines ran across the shape, not around the shape like the previous delta. So, in order to combine these, you use these top magnets as markers, and one way they'll connect nicely, and the other way they won't. So, you know that 
this is the way that they have to be combined. So in order to combine them, you have some options. You can remove these nine magnets here and stick this one onto there, or you can build a layer of four magnets here and stick this one onto here. I think that's a bit easier. And now just fill in the gaps. Have it. These can be made into a ring, while if you use the other type of delta, you can only use it for shapes with an even number of connections.